Hi everyone. So this question says that a pizza shop has five uh, favorite toppings. Then the number of different ways of selecting one or more of these toppings is okay. Five different toppings. Choosing one or more toppings. Wow. Well, okay. I could choose one of those toppings, or I could choose two of those toppings, or three of those toppings, or four of those toppings, or I could choose all five of them. Now, important to note here, okay, that this this is almost a complete a complete set of combinations here. I am just missing five choose zero, where you choose none of them. Okay? Now that means that this is going to be the same as two to the fifth. Okay? Well, it, this is almost the same right now. This is approximately the same. I'm one term missing here. There's been a term that's been removed from here, and that is that five choose zero. So I'm going to just now subtract five choose zero from two to the fifth. Okay, now five choose zero is just one. Two to the fifth is thirty-two. So basically, this is this is thirty-one. There are thirty-one ways I can go in there and order a pizza with one or more toppings. Okay, but you could either do it from scratch and do this whole thing here, or again. When you've got a whole run of combinations here, re remember this rule over here. If you've got n choose 0 plus n choose 1 plus dot 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 all the way out to n choose n, the answer here is 2 to the n. Okay, This is all I'm taking advantage of over here. Just that that first term had been missing. So because it had been subtracted from the left side, it's also being subtracted from that right side.